What are the ways in which I know how to not only nourish myself, but have a nourishing atmosphere for other people to come into? And I've had the experience many times where people come into a nourishing, joyous, wonderful atmosphere. People come to Sunrise Ranch, and they want to be here because they love it. And within a few breaths, they've already got great ideas about how we, can, how we should be doing it differently. <laughs> Anybody else had that experience? <laughs> There are many things that people react to that immediately take the atmosphere into a low level of let's survive this and get out of it as soon as we can. Sometimes it's a conversation. Sometimes it's a meeting. I've been in a lot of meetings where I'm doing this, how much longer do we have to be in this atmosphere? As opposed to another meeting where I've been in, it's like already over? How wonderful the generation was of the time with the people, the consideration and the high invitation to uh, the greatness of each other? Can you walk into a situation and provide that which is going to make the atmosphere go up? That which is going to let the people in the room feel nourished? That which will bring insight and love as opposed to challenge and questioning? I think it takes a long time to be in a situation before you have even the um, tools to ask a question that can assist as opposed to challenge in a way that will um, ruin the atmosphere. And I'm not saying that questions aren't valuable. I promise you, I am one of the most challenging people in that way. But it's out of respect for the people um, who invited me into their, their situation. I am in a place this morning of the invitation of longing to be nourished and longing to know how to nourish you. I think that's what real community is about. Not just like sitting around and feeding each other grapes and bonbons. <laughs> that's not very nourishing past um, the 10th grape anyway. <laughs> and certainly not past the 10th bonbon. <laughs> but there are things we can do to um, soothe and bless and hold the heart of each other and also lift the spirit, and the physical experience of another person. I'm paying attention. Not only to the ways in which I'm not doing it right, but to the ways in which it feels amazing to be in your company.